Hello you guys, it is the 3rd of December and I just got done taking a shower, uh, washing my hair, so something I never really mentioned in my get to know me videos um, is that since I'm biracial, it's not a requirement for me to wash my hair daily, so I really only wash my hair like once every month, um, which typically um, does me good. If I were to wash my hair anymore, it'd be a hassle. It takes so long to get my hair back um, to straight just because my hair is naturally curly and it's just, it takes a long time. It probably takes like two, three hours um, all at once for me to get my hair back to quote unquote normal and I wouldn't be up for that. Plus that's a lot of heat damage, so. I do try my best to uh, not overwash my hair, to not over like do it with like the flat iron or the curling iron, either or, but yeah, so good morning. Um, Oliver is sleeping on my bed, and like I said before, I just came out of the shower, so <laughs> um, yeah. If anyone's curious about what I use on my hair, I just finished this bottle because like I found it downstairs, I was just like... I left this here and forgot about it when I moved out. There's still actually a little bit in there still. But I use the Fructis, so I always use like the green bottle. I did try using the pear stuff, but I can't stand the smell of it because it smells like my aunt and my aunt is old. <laughs> so unless you want to like smell like an old aunt, then like that's a nope for me. <laughs> but. I used the rest of that, and then I used the the um, conditioner version of this. I know it's all backwards. Again, I'm sorry, but you know. Really, Oliver? That's his pillow he's supposed to be, uh, you know, using to prevent flathead. He's so weird because he sleeps with his eyes open. <laughs> Jeez. And excuse the huge mess. This is what we're going to be doing today. So, yeah, like the room's kind of a mess. Hey, you. It's like almost nine o'clock. Yeah, he needs a bath today as well. So, probably going to do that. Do some home stuff. We won't be going out today. As much as I love going out and shopping, I need to stop. Um, I'm still kind of disappointed about yesterday, though. Like, we only found two shirts for Oliver. Speaking of which, I don't think I ever got to show you guys what we got Oliver. So, first thing I got him was an Ohio State shirt because the finale, or not the finale, the finals, or whatever the heck they call it. Um, champions, that's what it is. The champions is coming up and Ohio's in it, so got him that. And then I got him this shirt. Like, Loki, those were the only two things I could find for him. Like I said, I'm pretty much a very, um, a very picky mom when it comes to clothes. That's just how I am. And then I also found him a pair of shoes, which barely fit, but oh well. So here is Oliver's stocking. It's funny because I have my first stocking. This is my stocking. I know it's gross. It's old. This is baby's first Christmas. And then Oliver's right here says baby's first Christmas. And he actually has a little present in there. So that's so I'm going to bring you guys into my personal life. This was a message I just received from someone recently. I've been getting a lot of messages from guys out of the country. Like, I don't even know where MO is. Um, it's like, I've been blocking everyone that's been doing that. But I just want to show you the list of just all these people within the time frame. I mean, like... I know her so that she doesn't count, but there are just so 
many people and I don't even know what this person said like he sent me something and then like removed it I basically just blocked everyone and then like hold on this is like my personal messages so I'm gonna try and not show you guys these ones because these ones are kind of the people I talk to but um okay like right here so I was selling some bras or trying to sell some bras on here and like these are the bras I was trying to sell and this dude named Justin like just read these messages I'm gonna scroll through them Like, people are so... Like, it's a guy and he was looking for girl clothes, like, bras and stuff. Or anyone wanting to model. And just a little background, you guys. I've been doing some quote-unquote modeling. Modeling? <laughs> modeling. And, like, it's personal modeling for, like, myself. But... Yeah, I just thought it was a little strange, so I blocked the dude. Like, you really can't trust anyone online these days. And then on Sunday, I had someone messaging me um, who was, like, really ready to, like, jump into a relationship, ready to get married, have a baby. Um, and it's just, like, these things don't just happen. You don't just get with someone and you have a baby. You don't just get with someone and... You automatically get married. Like, I can't really say much about that on that whole situation because, like, Henderson. But I trusted Henderson, and Henderson lived... I can't say that either. Like, he's he lives in the United States. He just lives in Alaska. People don't realize that Alaska is connected to the United States. Well, not connected to the United States, but it's part of the United States. And that gets kind of annoying. But this dude was all the way, like, in a different country and... He's talking about having a serious relationship. Like, how are we supposed to have a serious relationship if you're all the way across the country? And yeah, good morning. Good morning. I'm getting all sassy this morning. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's like, how are we supposed to have a serious relationship if you're, like, all the way across the country? He said I could fly, but I'm just like, that's expensive. Like, this dude said he lives in, like, Greece and... You know, I know flights from, like, Ohio to Florida, those are, like, you know, 200 between $200, $500. And then you got to think to fly out of your country to another country. Like, that's got to be at least more than $1,000 of a flight. And I'm not just talking round trip either. Like, that's got to be a lot of money. And he's like, oh, that's okay. I'm just like, really? Like, that's okay? And I hate it. Honestly, I'm... Um, kind of looking for a relationship but kind of not like I feel like I should be with someone but at the same time I kind of feel like I should lay low for a little bit and kind of like not be in a relationship because I feel like I'm doing good on my own right now would you quit kicking my computer stop yeah quit before I spank your butt you think I'm this child you think it's a joke this is an expensive computer, boy. What are you doing? I'm gonna say good morning. Here, just take it. Just take it. You know you want to. Just hold it. Don't smack yourself in the face with it. Oh my god. And don't cut your computer. Here, can you hold this, please? Okay. He's got my phone, so... Oh, don't eat it! He thinks everything that he sees he can eat. There's your toy over there. Like, I'd rather have you destroy this than my computer. Thank you. So, I slept the day away. Just ordered me food. Stop. I hate this show. Because it's stupid. 
Good luck to both of you. Here we go. Name something you flex. Your muscles. I'm not really kind of forced to watch it because I'm down here. I should probably start to take my PlayStation up. We were watching scammers talking to this dude and it was pretty funny. It stomach hurts. I didn't think it was going to go through for a minute. But, uh... Hello you guys, welcome to day number four of Vlogmas. I do want to apologize for not being able to upload this in uh, separate videos, but I didn't have enough recording time to make it into um, one vlog plus. It was kind of boring, so I was just like, we're just going to combine the two days. So right now I'm in my house, or say what used to be my house. Technically I can still call it my house because it still has my stuff in it, but um, these drawers need to be in my room today and we're also going to try to move this over so it's going to be great um personally i think this is going to be a lot heavier than moving um the dresser that was in my room originally in my room at my mom's house so the only reason why i say that is because that was pretty light and, like, I was able to lift that dresser up on my own. Like, I wasn't able to carry it, but I was able to lift it up. With this one, it's a little bit more difficult because it's, like, I mean, like, I guess I could lift it. But it just seems to be a lot more heavier and it's a lot more fragile. Um, for those of you who don't know, I did buy this myself when I was uh, pregnant. <laughs> um... I built it in here. This cost me like 300 bucks, so I do want to be super careful with that. I mean, it's already starting to like chip a little bit, but that's because the drawers have been having some like issues and been getting stuck lately, so I mean that, but I'm also missing a piece from the drawer when I was putting the drawer together, and I'm hoping, you know, I'm hoping after officially clearing this room out, because I mean like the room is empty, but it's not like completely empty yet. I'm hoping I find that extra piece because one of these dressers, there's like little bolts on the sides that keeps it together. And I'm missing just one bolt. And it's not like it's very crucial or anything, but I would just love to have it so that way it stays together. And, you know, so... Yeah, so I'm just going to start hauling these over. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I figured I'd do this early and, you know, kind of get ready because I did order a TV stand for my room because I'm tired of my TV being on the floor. And I mean, like, my TV's only been on the floor for like a month. So it's not like a big deal to me, but I do want my room to be set up properly. So got to work on that too. But the good part is, is that the dresser drawers are in here, and then the last one is outside that door. So I was thinking about putting it right there, just because I have stuff over there, like his swing and what's not. And I was thinking about maybe just putting his dresser over there, but there's a little flaw in my room, and I don't know if you guys, like, realize, because there's, like, a spot there missing that's actually a secret, um, a secret, like, safe almost. My mom told me about that, that there's, like, hidden family stuff in there, and I had no idea. But, like, there's pieces of the floor that is missing, and in that corner, it's really bad. Like, this is where my last dresser, dresser was, and it's just, it's really bad. Like, the floor looks pretty bad in here, but I'm not putting carpet down. I'm not going to try to fix the floor. It's just, it can stay the way it stayed, because this is the same floor... Hello. This is the same floor I had in my sister had. So, what are you doing? I see you're awake. Can I change your butt? 
you. It's just talking about you. Yeah. So just gonna show you guys something funny. <laughs> My child thinks evil laughs are funny. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. What's up, everybody? I am maybe Haber. No, we're watching paternity court and making fun of these people because, like, people want to pose like they big old parent, but they ain't. <laughs> Oh yeah, and we're also putting up ornaments. Trevor's got two little balls. <laughs> bye bye. Oh yeah, um, cringy me from third grade. <laughs> Doofy. And then they got twelve-year-old me, which I put in the back of the tree because no one needs to see that. Why? Because I was. Let everyone see I mean, I had perfect glowy skin when I was 12, but uh, that's about it. Everything else was kind of kerfuckled. And now a word from our sponsor. All right, everybody, welcome back. This is my segment here, folks. And uh, today we are just gonna just stand here in silence with other things going around. Hmm. Anyways, you should all follow me, add me on, uh, I don't know, uh, add me on YouTube, subscribe if you want to, I talk about history and politics, and there's a lot of gaming and random stuff going on for the rest of 2019. Woo! So make sure you all check that out, hopefully Kachina will put a link of my channel uh, in the description below, since I put a link of her channel in the description of one of my uh, most recent videos that actually came out on Monday where we uh, sucked some helium out of some balloons that I actually recorded like months ago and just now decided to uh, post it because uh, yeah I need to get rid of stuff so yeah hopefully you all subscribe to my channel a lot of fun stuff if you have any suggestions on anything I should do on my channel be sure to let me know in the comments of anything below or shoot me a message or whatever. You can follow me on any of the social media on my channel. So everything will be there. Just, uh, you know, be sure to do that. And that was a word of our sponsor. So this is what the, uh, the tree now looks like. We're just gonna do your weeble wobble. I'm just gonna try to show as much as I possibly can. We don't have our star because uh, our star, which is right here, doesn't work. So we gotta go out and find another one. And uh, yeah, as you see there, cringe. And also more cringe. So what do you have to say for uh, days two and three combined into one video. Two and three? You're off. It's three and four. Whatever. What, what should I say about it? I don't know. Babies are expensive. You should see all the presents that Oliver has and those chores. He's spoiled. I spoil my child. All right, Oliver, say bye.